With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Let's start the question. The question says that to show that simple pendulum executes simple harmonic motion, it is necessary to assume that. Now, when we are trying to find out the time period of simple pendulum, so if this is the simple pendulum, I am going to give it a small displacement. So let's say I am going to give it a small displacement in this direction. It oscillates on the other side. So at a displaced position, I need to find out whether there is going to be a restoring force. If at all there is a restoring force, then we would be telling that it is going to oscillate. So you know that vertically downward there is going to be mg acting. Let's say it is displaced by a small angle theta. So if I am resolving this mg, I'll be getting mg sin theta component which is towards the center or towards the where the mean position is there that is it acts like a restoring force. Instead of acting like a restoring force, it's now going to act like a restoring torque for producing this angular oscillations. So whatever torque is generated that will be equal to mg sin theta into L. Now to derive the time period of simple pendulum, the assumptions we are going to make is that small angle assumptions. So if the angle subtended or the angle moved by the pendulum is small, this implies that amplitude of oscillations is also small. So we are going to assume that amplitude of the simple pendulum will be small and then we are going to derive the expression for the time period. So the correct option will be the fourth option amplitude of oscillation is small. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.